how to get more email subscribers 10 lead magnet ideas have you been trying to build your email list but you're stuck because you really can't think of any ideas what to give people what do you do for lead magnets you're gonna want to watch this video because I'm gonna give you 10 awesome lead magnet ideas that will make you money and help you grow your list great ideas that you can use today to build your list and grow your business and we're starting right now hey I'm JR Fisher welcome to my channel if you're brand new here don't forget to subscribe there's a big subscribe button down there check it out hit that button and don't forget there's a bell next to it you got to hit the bell oh my god the button without the bell you got to hit the bell because the bell are notifications so you can subscribe to the channel but you won't know if I did a video unless you turn on all notifications so you want to click that bell and turn on all notifications you'll be part of the VIP Fisher family and I can let you know every time I upload a video every time I go live a little about me my name is JR Fisher and I've been selling online since 2009 we sold millions of dollars of both digital and physical products and I've learned a lot along the way and on this channel I share those things with you I share with you how you can start run and grow an online business so check it out we have our own branded products that are on thousands of websites including Walmart so all I do is I share with you on this channel what works and what possibly doesn't work so that you can get better results all right let's jump right into this lead magnets are an awesome way to build your list but you can't always come up with great ideas for lead magnets so I'm gonna give you six right now that are definitely great ideas they work for us they work for many other people and you can use them in your business I also want to let you know that at the end of this video in the description there's a link that you can click and get a $97 e-commerce course absolutely free no credit card required so check that out at the end okay first off I want to tell you what not to do now years ago people love to get emails they just love to get emails nowadays not so much okay I don't get excited when I look in there and I see I've got 400 emails to go through okay that just wastes my time so if you're telling people to sign up for your newsletter or to sign up for more content they're probably not gonna do it you're gonna to have to give them something of value for them to give up their email so please keep that in mind no more sign up for my newsletters nobody wants your newsletter anymore okay and I'll tell you the the size of your actual lead magnet has changed too it used to be people felt like you know they'd get a lot more value if they had a 30 or 100 page report and nowadays not so much okay people don't want to read 30 40 50 pages of anything anymore they want it concise they want it valuable and that's really to your advantage because you don't have to spend as much time on it either now number one and I really like this one a lot is called a resource list so a resource list is exactly what it sounds like it's a list of things that people can go through and they can actually find the information they want so it may be a resource list for going camping okay the, the 20 things you need for a safe camping trip it could be a list of credit card processing companies that have low fees it could be a list of camera equipment that you need to shoot videos but resource lists are great because people can get that one page that one sheet and go through there and say these are the things I need and they can just check them off as they go so number one right off the bat is resource list number two is a quick start guide now I'm one of those guys who you know when I get anything that has to be put together or you have to learn how to use something whether it's a camera or a computer or whatever I jump on that quick start guide you know so if you can provide people with a quick start guide what that really translates to is that's gonna save me time time because quick start means I can get going right away I don't have to read a 50 page manual I don't have to read a hundred pages on how to set stuff up your quick start guide can actually be on one page right that's awesome and sometimes it's just diagrams as to what somebody needs to do so my number two vote is for a quick start guide check it out use those people love them number three is a cheat sheet people love cheat sheets if you can provide them a way that they can save themselves once again a whole lot more time with a cheat sheet that's pretty cool stuff you know it can be how to set up a sales page you know the seven cheat sheet steps to setting up a sales page it can be to how to set up your kitchen for baking it can be for you know how to go on a camping trip the cheat sheet of things that you'll need for your camping camping trip people love the word cheat sheet now keep in mind a lot of these words are interchangeable so a resource list could also be called a cheat sheet if you wanted to and you can test those out and see which ones work better for you 
number four is a frequently asked question video okay now that's pretty cool a lot of people don't do that they'll have on their website frequently asked questions but people have to kind of dig through everything to find what they want but if you actually do a video people are more apt to opt in for a video of frequently asked questions than they are text why because they can just watch it okay they can watch it on the go if they've got a headset in they can listen to it they can get the information they want now the one thing I'll tell you on videos is becoming more and more important and I'm really working on it myself and that is to have closed captions on your videos now it used to be closed captions were super important because people who were hearing impaired needed to read the words on the screen but it's not really used so much for that anymore sure hearing impaired people want to have closed captions that makes sense but the average person wants to have them too because they're on the go they're on their mobile phone maybe they're in the middle of a meeting and they're not interested in the meeting and they want to look at your video and they can look down at the phone and they can actually read what it's saying but they can't turn up the volume because they don't want anybody around them to know what they're listening to or maybe they're in a crowded airport where they can't hear well so if you put words on the screens on all your videos it doesn't matter what it is whether it's your sales page whether it's your you know video of frequently asked questions you know it doesn't matter what it is having those words there will be beneficial to you because there's always a certain population that are just going to be using that mobile all the time and if you're just using mobile and you've got audio they can't watch your video so make sure you're putting closed captions on absolutely everything you do next up is a checklist oh my god I love checklists I love checklists because everybody worries about missing something having something that's not done and if I've got this checklist I've got a couple little boxes off to the side I can just go through this checklist and make sure I've got everything done so it could be a checklist on how to you know upload videos to YouTube it could be a checklist on how to build a sales page it could be a checklist on how to do an email sequence checklists are invaluable because that way it lets the person know that they haven't missed anything and that's what you're trying to do is help them out once again save them time number six is email scripts or templates okay these are awesome because a lot of people don't have the talent maybe to write an email they don't have the talent to do that so if you give them a sample a you know scripted one a templated one that they can just interchange some words in there some products in there that helps them out tremendously so that's my number six is email scripts number seven is a mini course yeah a mini course okay and I'm gonna give that to you too also because in the description there's a $97 e-commerce course and it's a mini course on e-commerce you can go down in the description for free and grab this $97 course you don't have to pay anything for it you don't need a credit card I would suggest you check that out but people love these little mini courses because it gives them an insight into your business and it gives them the training they need and if they like it they may actually buy something from you so when you go through my course if you like the course you may actually buy one of my paid courses also so those are a great way to build your list number eight is also a course but it's an email course so they can sign up for your email course where over a period of five days each day they get one email and it may have one lesson in it so over a period of five days they can go through your entire course but it's designed to be set up in all of your emails that's a great way to get your content out there and help people out number nine some of you guys have done something really cool and you may not be taking advantage of it but that is you wrote a book so number nine is give them sample chapters of your book hey if you've got a great book and you give them the first two or three chapters out of 20 or 30 they're gonna get interested okay most people in their books kind of allude to what they're gonna talk about later on in their books so if you do that and people start reading your book they're gonna want the rest of it so what you do is you give them the first two or three chapters and say hey if you'd like to complete this book click this button here you can get it for half price you can get it for 70 percent off whatever you want to do have some incentive there since they've already downloaded the first couple chapters to get the rest of your book so if you've got a book out there if you've written a book or if you want to write a book try that method it will really help you build your list number 10 basically the same idea but different give them sample modules of your course now we've got a lot of courses I have some courses that have over a hundred videos in there so what I could do is like let's say my Facebook ads course I could say hey you know you can get the first two modules of my Facebook ads course you get 10 videos and that will show you how to set up your account and get you rolling but if you want to know how to do the rest of the Facebook ads if you want to know how to do audiences and targeting and you know building stuff and you know doing images and testing stuff you'd have to pay for the rest of the course but you get them in and if they like the beginning of your course many of those people will actually buy your course so that's my number 10 
now when you use these ideas guys you're actually giving people content and things they can use if you give them something they can use if they see the value they're gonna be a whole lot more apt to spend money with you than if they don't okay it only makes sense if I get a taste of something and it's really really good and when I say taste of something I actually mean that because we have survival foods and we used to give out survival foods at gun shows and we'd say hey taste this food see what you think people would love it and they would actually buy the product if I hadn't have given them that sample if I hadn't have given them that literal taste of the food they probably wouldn't have bought so these things work really really well and you need to do them in your business you need to give out what you have and if you have information let's say you have services if you give them a sample of that service they're gonna see the value of it provided you have value okay and they're gonna want more of what you got so my suggestion is to try these things out if you give that value up front guys you're gonna be able to build your list and more importantly you'll build your sales I hope you appreciated this video hey in the comments below put in there what you want to know about let me know what do you have questions about which one of these things do you think is gonna work best for you which ones have you tried out I really want to hear your comments don't forget to like this video if you haven't subscribed make sure you do so now hit that subscribe button and next to it ring the bell hit the bell when you hit the bell you want to turn on all notifications that'll make you part of my family the Fisher family the VIP group that gets notified about these videos and nobody else does but you that's pretty cool stuff don't forget grab my course $97 e-commerce course absolutely free all you got to do is click and learn thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video Hey, thanks for watching my video don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click that little bell right here so you can be notified every time I do a new video also click on one of those videos there keep watching on my channel